Use case modelling. A use case is a technique for describing the functional requirements of a system. A use case is associated with a goal, for example, book of light, subscribe to a service, detect intruders. A use case describes interactions between a system and its users. A use case represents a collection of scenarios. Scenarios can lead to success or failure, where success corresponds to achieving the goal. Users are identified with so-called actors, where actors specify a role, for example, customer, recruitment officer, human resources manager. A user can take on multiple roles, for example, an employee could act as both a recruitment officer as well as a human resources manager. Actors are not restricted to humans. They can also denote other systems or even time. All human actors will be stakeholders, but not all stakeholders will necessarily be actors. For example, users. Identifying system boundary. When designing a system, it is best to decide where the boundary between the system and its environment lies. If a system boundary is absent or poorly defined, then errors will typically arise. For example, is the calculation of a customer's credit rating the responsibility of the system under development or another third-party system? Best to catch such errors as early as possible. Representing use cases. A use case has two parts. A use case means diagram and specifications. Note, a specification is a textual description. Diagram defines the system boundary, identifies the actors and their associated use cases. Specification defines the actors, applicability and effects of a use case, defines the scenarios associated with a use case. Identifying use cases. One approach is to start by constructing a list of actors and how they will use a system. Distill from the list a set of use cases, best to use a verb in constructing the use case names. The name should reflect the goal of the use case. Note that use case modelling typically involves refinement and revision, success through understanding your failures. When applied effectively, the process of developing use cases should help both developers and stakeholders better understand the functional requirements.